Hi, my peeps. My peeps, my peeps. So today is our makeup collection day. And I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven small palettes we're going to go through. Um, the majority of, majority of them are all from Urban Decay. I have two that Santa brought me that are probably from Walmart. <laughs> um, I don't know if I picked them out or if I don't even remember like where they came from, but they're like no name, just makeup palette, like smaller makeup palettes, like with six six shadows or something. As you can see, I am kind of playing up my look today. Yes, I am all like jazzed out but my hair it's just it's not working i need volume i'm not getting my volume <laughs> like crazy this is portuguese hair when you don't do anything to it you just want to like let it be <laughs> but then when you have it up like the day before it's all flat <laughs> so let's go ahead I'm going to put, because I have the one we just used on the bottom, oh, well, it was on the top, now it's on the bottom, so, um, this first one is one I did get for Christmas, it's like one of those no-namers that, you know, I got it for Christmas, oh, this one has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten shadows in it, and it comes with a little plastic covering and then like two of the little well like a dual ended sponge you know eyeshadow I don't even remember what they're called anymore because I don't use them but so these are not named there's no name for these colors but I will swatch them for you this one is like something I would want to use for a highlight pretty simple the next one is kind of a shimmery pinkish pinkish pink or peak pinkish peach and then the next one is kind of a brown brown oh actually it's like more like an orangey orangey bronze color and then this is like a soft pink You wipe those off. So I can get the rest of them for you. But I do have fun with these. Even though they're, I mean, they, they work okay. They're not super great, but, I mean, they do their job. So let's start with this hand. So now I'm going to go in with the next bottom color here kind of a gold like kind of like Nyx's highlight but with shimmer and then this is like more of a gold like a true gold with a little bronze to it and then we have like a mint matte or more of a silk actually silk base so that's like a, a minty color and then this is basically like another mint color but kind of shimmery <laughs> wipe those off I love those no name palettes I mean, if they work, they work. I mean, I've used them before. They've been just fine, so. And the last one is this. Ugh, Looks kind of blue on camera, but um, it's actually a green. It's like a dark green. Boop. Same. So that's that one. Okay, I'm 
next one is basically the same kind of palette. It's got, looks like the same amount. One, two, three, four, five. I have ten shadows. And these are more like blues. So it's like the other ones are more like neutrally colors. Oh my goodness. No snagging. So these are more like ocean colors. I have my bracelet on too loose. So let me swatchy swatch for you. So this one is like very light. Like yeah, these ones that one comes off a little better than this one does. Very light blue. And then it's like it gets darker as it goes. You can see that how it's getting darker. It's like the next one's super dark. These ones, the color doesn't seem to, this one seems to be pretty good. And then the next one is very, very pale um, blue, so you could barely even see it on my stinking hand. Let me wipe that off. I'll wipe all these colors off my hands. I don't want to get any of those in my clothes. I should have tightened that. I figure for you guys, at least I can, like, dress up a little bit so I don't look all, like, homely. <laughs> I just wish I had some volume. <laughs> volume! I should have put, like, a in the bath. There we go. That works a little bit better. Alright. You sleeves of hand. So here would be a good highlight. Yeah, don't. This is getting caught on my little bat wing um, poncho. Um, this is like NYX highlight color. Yeah, like that's like barely even coming off not too happy with the color payout on that one. This is like an orange, like an orange. You can see, you know, this palette compared to the last palette is not paying off as well as far as, well that one came out good and that's because, yeah I did that on purpose. <laughs> that is this dark one right here. <laughs> so yes, that one did come through. It really came through. It's like, I'm gonna pop right off your hand. Here's another goldish bronze. Not really too great of color payoff. I don't think in my opinion. This is just my opinion. It doesn't have to be your opinion. You might like these and go, hey, I'm going to go check out like Walmart or wherever it might sell that and find this. There's literally no name. None. Not a name at all. <laughs> so I don't know where they're from. I'm guessing it was like in a stocking section, like stocking stuff for a section. And that's where they were picked up. Okay, so now we're going to start this way, this way going this way. So, like the darker ones seem to have better color payoff. That's like a, almost like, like a, oh, what's that color for MAC? It's like one of the most popular colors. It's like a black with shimmer. I haven't used it in so long I don't even remember the stinking name. The bottom ones seem to have a better color payoff. Interesting. So there's that color. Hmm. 
that's more of just like a true black or actually it looks more like a really dark brown when you look at it close up this is like really orange peachy orange My poor fingers. They're like, what are you doing? Stop coloring me. And we've got more palettes. More palettes to do this to. <sighs> Come off. I mean, I guess I can say they do want to stay on my fingers, so that's a good thing. With a good primer, it seems like they would stay. And then the last one, I don't know if I, I'm guessing I told you. You could barely even see it, but it would be a good highlighting color. It's like some of them come off really well. It seems like the darker ones come off really well, and then the lighter ones don't really come off as well. So now on to my Urban Decay palettes, because that is what's left for me to show you. I'll try to get this plastic back on here. Because I do like to keep them covered. If I can. Come on, seriously? This can't be that hard. Fix it this way. No, it goes this way. Because that was tape. Why is it not fit now? Oh, forget it. Forget it, forget it, forget it. I don't care. <laughs> like, really, I don't care. Okay, so... This... Anytime we would see, like, even my husband, he would notice that, like, oh, they have these Urban Decay palettes, because, like, they would always, they, and they're not, it's not in there. It always come with a primer, and then in here would be a 24-7 pencil, and, um, my, well, zero, 24-7 and zero, like, that's always the color it came with. So, you know, they would be like 10 bucks, you know, when normally they're like 50. So, anytime we... <laughs> my husband's so cute that he actually knows, like, what I like. So, if we, him or I, saw that either Sephora, Ulta, or the Urban Decay site were selling these, we always bought them because it's just cheaper. You get shadows and a stinking pencil so and they're all named so the first one here is like a pinkish like a peachy pink shimmery color called snatch I love their names and urban decay shadows always have great payoff so that would be a really, just that and a little bit of dark on the outside, great daytime color. And then we have Mildew, which is like, kind of like a sea foam green. And you can obviously see the color payoff on these are much, much better. This is Flash, this purple color, which I love my purples. Purples and I get along very well. Like, ah! Looks blue on camera, but that's totally purple. Yeah, I promise it's purple. I'm not lying to you. And then we're going to go down here, and this is Toasted. It's like a, you know, taupey bronze color. Now let's take this off my hand. This is, like, supposed to be a short <laughs> thing, and this is probably going to take a while. But I just, you know, I want to swatch them for you. I want you guys to actually see 
what they look like. Okay, so then we have this one, which is Smog, which I think these are colors that you can buy by themselves. I love that. And then this is Painkiller. I love their names. <laughs> look at that. Padow. That's pretty. I have just the base for this. We can do something really rad with that and add glitter. <gasps> yes. So that, um, does this one have a name? Urban Decay. What palette is this? It just says Urban Decay on it. A lot of them, you know, they're named, but I don't see, um, um, the name on them. The only one that, because I still have the case, that I know the name is lost when I have is Dangerous. But I'll show you that again. So then there's this one, which, oh, oh, look, there's a brand new pencil in there, never been used. <laughs> awesome! So I don't even know if I've used this palette yet. This one, oh, yeah, okay, they are. I didn't, because of the way that they're written, I thought that they weren't named. So let's start this way and go this way. So there's six shadows. This one is me. Minx? Minx, yeah. So let's go this way. This is kind of like a color that, that um... The color that is on like one of those other palettes. Here's a nice gold. It's called Herb. So that would be. It's kind of kind of flaky. Probably because I've like cleaned my fingers. Here's a good silver called gunmetal. I do believe this is a um, color that they sell individually. And then now we're going to go this way to this way. So this is a holy, holy baked. Love this. This would be good for like another Arabic look. Look at that. And it's not even like a true gold. The, like with the Urban, Urban Decay Primer, the new one, it would look really good with that. I might have to get me another wipe. <laughs> I think I'm going to get a new one. Yeah. Come on. Because it's not coming off as well. I think it's kind of drying out. <laughs> And yes, I know my fingernails are still terrible. I'm just going to go Saturday. I don't know if I said it or not already because I say things like 25 times. I know I do it. I watch the video and go, dang it, why do I have to say things so many times? Um, and then the next one is Smog, which I believe is, I think I already have this one. Oh well, I don't care if I have the same color twice. And then twice bait. So we will be coming up with looks for these palettes in the future. Don't you worry your pretty little heads. And then I have that pencil in there still. Hurrah, hurrah. Okay, we only have three palettes left. And then the next one is the Urban Decay, the Feminine Palette. This one actually has the name on it. Wait, does this one? It says, we don't do animal testing. How could anyone? Oh, that's why there's all the animals on it with the dolphin and all the great stuff. That's so awesome. Lovey Urban Decay. 
that pencil that or the not the pencil but the uh, volume um the not the pencil but the sharpener yeah good buy if you want a really good pencil sharpener go out and get yourself that urban decay yeah it's ten dollars i know that's like ridiculous to spend on a stinking sharpener but it's the i have probably 10 other sharpeners and that is the best pencil sharpener i have ever used i'm not saying out i don't work for urban decay i'm not promoting them they don't give me free stuff or anything but yeah like that is seriously the best pencil sharpener i have ever used go buy it now <laughs> so this is Urban Decay the Feminine Palette. Is there a, <laughs> another pencil? <laughs> Yay! Oh, wait, hold on. I just don't want stuff falling out. So I'm trying to be careful. So <laughs> and they're always in zero. And those are my favorite pencils, so like I really don't care. So the next one is called, the, we're going to go from, don't fall out, you, this way, this way, down this way, this way. So this is Stray Dog, this brownish color. It's like a silky, kind of a taupey, shimmery taupey. And then this is Swiss, and it's a pinkish, shimmery pink. Then this is Midnight Cowboy, or this is more of a shimmery peach. If you can kind of tell the difference between the two here. And then this purple one is going this way now is ecstasy, ecstasy, ecstasy. This one is a matte color, which is pretty light. Looks blue on camera. It's frustrating. I'm going to get some lights. But I have to get those big, like, umbrella lights and I gotta figure out how I'm gonna arrange it. So don't worry, I will be getting them. It's just I have to figure out where they're gonna go because this room is not super huge and we have a very large keyboard to this side of me. My amps, a bass, a guitar, and right up against the stinking closet is one of those cycles like for this, like a spin cycle exercise bike, um, like in spin classes, and then bed. So it's like, I'm going to have to put those, like, I need those lights on each side of me. Technically, I need them behind me. You guys would see them. So I would have to completely, I'll figure it out. I promise, guys. And then... Because lighting, literally, lighting is, like, the most important thing. And I have that mirror coming. I don't know why, like, something that I literally bought that is up the street, and it's coming from that store, it's going to take, like, days and days and days to get here. I think the, like, a shipment that I was supposed to get today is, like, I have so so much stuff it's stressing me out I did not mean to go on such a rampage so I'm constantly going to my email to check these statuses and it's hard to stink and keep track so where are we at okay we did ecstasy last so now we're going to be we're going with the brown on here this is dark horse Nice brown with shimmer, and then Aquarius, which is a mint shimmery. So 
So that's all of the feminine palette. Next is the black palette. This, if I remember, I think this is the first one I got and I really, 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 really loved it. This probably has <laughs> pencil in it too. I wouldn't be surprised. But it's good to know that I still have my pencils that there are still, I have quite a few of the 24-7 pencils in zero. That, that's good for me to know. Yeah, see, this one I knew I didn't have. Because this is the one that I've used the most. Because these are some really great colors. And the color payoff on this one, like the looks I have come up with this palette, or, I mean, you guys can see it's definitely been used, but I have so many of these palettes that um, I try to rotate. So the first one is Black Dog, and it's just your, i got to be careful with this, just a matte, maybe with a tiny bit of sparkle in there, black. I mean, that is black. And then we have um, Barracuda, which is not far off from the black dog. It's like almost the same color, but this one is more of like the darkest silver you can get with some shimmer. Then we have Jet, which is this purple color here, which I'm in love with, and I'll probably marry one day. Look at that. I mean, you can see it's purple on this. So, I mean, the payoff on this is amazing. And then um, Libertine, this green one. Oh, oh. oh my God, I love this color. Look at that. Oh my god. Sorry, I'm sorry. I can't help it. I love this palette. This has to probably be my ultimate favorite, favorite, favorite Urban Decay palette that I have. And yes, like I said, we will be coming up with looks for them. I promise. I promise, 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 promise. It's just, I have... You know, that's why I'm doing this, because I want you guys to understand that trying to think of a look when you have so much stuff, it's like there's so many ideas that I have in my head, and it's like what products are, are going to work best for that. So the next one, did I do all of them? Yeah, I did. Right? I did? No. I know I did the Libertine next is Cobra. This one is like a true gold dark bronzy. I mean it's like gold and dark and gorgeous and then this is Sabbath. Oh my gosh. Blue and sparkly. I mean look at these colors. Look at how pigmented they are. Like, like if you can find this palette, I mean, this is kind of an older palette. The black palette, I mean, check Amazon, go on to eBay, whatever you can do. Try to find that palette if you already have it. That's awesome. We'll do looks with these. I promise it's just a matter of time and me going, hmm, what am I inspired by? I've already thought, like, I know we did a pinup look, but I kind of want to do a a cabaret look, inspired look, because then we can, like, get really artsy and start, like, you know, using gemstones on our eyes and, like, okay, what, some movie with Christina, I, I, I don't even know the name of the movie, but Cher with Christina Aguilera, I'm sure you guys know what movie I'm talking about, it was on. And I was looking at the makeup, and I was getting totally inspired. And I was like, yeah, but we just did that, you know, pinup look. And, but, so, I'll wait a little bit, and then we'll do that. Because, almost kind of the same types of makeup, 
that, you know, I want lots of crazy black eyeliner and crystals and crazy red lip and so, yeah, I'm, not, I'm sorry. So, and then this is the one we just used for our last tutorial. I'm just going to show everybody just in case you haven't seen it. And this one is the Dangerous palette with the little, um, I like that they kind of switched it up and instead of like throwing the pencil in there, they threw the little lip gloss. So I probably will like only use this lip gloss either if doing a tutorial or if like I leave town, I'll take this with me. So going the same way, like doo doo doo, first we have Gravity. Because, like, these are the colors we haven't used. Gravity. It's a dark purple, shimmery purple. We did use Loaded over that bronzy brown color, which was deeper. That looked so amazing over that bronzy brownish gold color. And then with that um, gold primer, the new primer underneath. Ooh, I just love that extra. If I... But they passed my house. Go back. 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 I'll never let go. I promise. I'll never let go. God. Okay, sorry. Sorry, movie moment. <laughs> and then another one we haven't used yet is Evidence. Evidence. I don't have any evidence of anything. Ooh, wait, woo! This right here, very blue. We haven't used that yet. Um, and then Ace. This is what we put in the outer corner for like our outer V. And then this is what we had in our crease was the mushroom. Sorry guys, it's like I have to clean. I just, you know, I don't want to get this on my clothes. <laughs> I really, really don't want to get this on my clothes. My hair is just so flat, like, oh, this weather is dumb. I was going to straighten it today, but I'm like, no, because that's just too much work and it's going to take me forever and I'm going to wash it in a couple of days anyways again. Like, I washed it yesterday. I wash my hair, like, every three days because, one, the weather is drier up here. So, I need more oil in my hair. So, it's better because normally when I, you know, where I used to live before, I, I didn't leave the house without washing my hair. Holy God. But, you know, now with, you know being in a whole different climate, I have to, you know, start doing some changes. And my hairdresser, who I really need to see, told me, you know, go a few days without, you know, washing your hair. So normally what I do is I'll wash my hair and I'll have it up one day. And the next day I'll straighten it. The next day I'll curl it. And then day after that I'll wash it. That's kind of how my hair routine goes, but I didn't do that. Today, yesterday I washed it. Today I was like, I'm just going to like frizz it out. <laughs> so, and then the last color on this is deeper, which we had on our lid. So, if you want to see the tutorial for that, go to, um, you can either find it here on YouTube. I did post it on my blog. J E A N A four eight H dot tumblr dot com and you will find a link for the tutorial there. So feel free to if you have this palette, it's still on sale guys. I can't believe like everything that I bought, all of it is still there and it's all still on sale. I'm 
if it wasn't for the fact that I've like gone crazy this month with buying stuff, I would go back on there and buy more of the eye pencils and buy more of the lip pencils because the lip pencils I already know I'm in love with. So, and I've heard great things about the eye pencils and then plus the glitters too. So, that is my set of small palettes. Like I said, mostly Urban Decay. I will be getting more. I do have some palettes coming in the mail that are not Urban Decay. That I have been wanting to try this brand because I don't have anything from this brand. So I'm really excited about it. I'm not going to tell you guys, oh, hair, it's just going to just fall flat. <sighs> Probably going to have to pull it back. <sighs> Help me, guys. So, because I need to cut it so it's, like, super dry anyways. Give me, I mean, look at this. I look like, <sighs> like I should be in a Pantene commercial or, like, a Garnier commercial going, damaged hair. Not anymore. And then, like, I'll spin in the chair and my hair will be all, like, silky and soft. Because, look at this. Yeah. So, if you got any ideas, because it does need to be dyed. It does need to be cut. If you have any good ideas of what you guys think would look good for my hair, please leave messages. So, that is that for my makeup collection um next week it'll be there my husband bought me this really big um nyx set i don't know if they still make these sets and it came with like a billion lip glosses so i have this glass jar full of these lip glosses and i will be showing you those next week so that is all for today, unless something shows up in the mail, and then I will be back. By the way, I did use my lip palette from Shawnee, and this is that, like, white one. It's just basically clear lip gloss, so. And then I am wearing a Shawnee eyeshadow. I didn't put anything on the top. I just did the, my waterline. Um, and then, yeah, I used that new mascara. I don't remember the brand. It came from that Holt Look package thing. I don't know if that mascara, they, they've just had it for 20 years or what, but mm, not so great, unfortunately. But, um... Yeah, I mean, it seemed like it was, like, really dried up. So maybe it was just something they had. They were trying to get rid of stuff. And so, all right, guys, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. I will see you tomorrow. Tomorrow, I because I have to think of something by tonight to show you guys tomorrow for our next tutorial. So... If you have any ideas or there's a certain look you do want me to do, please message me on any of, on Twitter, on all of my sites, my blog. You can find me on, you just Google my stinking name and just Google J-E-A-N-A-4-8-H, you'll find me. So I would really, really like some ideas for, um, you know, makeup looks. I do have ideas for makeup looks. I just don't want to be doing the same things you guys have already seen. So I'm trying to think of stuff that's a little on the different side. So we'll see. We'll see what I come up with. You never know. All right. Thank you, guys. Subscribe, 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 subscribe. I love you all, and thanks for watching.